And sure, there may be snow on the ground. We know that. Mm -hmm. But before you know it, the snow will melt away and everything's going to be bright and green. And if you need a quick taste of spring, you can get it today at the 18th Annual Portland Flower Show. WMTW News 8's Morgan Sturdivant live from the Portland Company Complex with more. Hey, Morgan. Hey, good morning, Katie and Norm. You know, I don't think I should have to go back out into winter. I just want to stay here with spring <laughs> from now on. But if you want to come get a taste of spring here, that's the theme at the Portland Flower Show this year. You really should because it is like taking a step into a really beautiful, beautiful springy spot. I'm back with Justina. Good morning good again. Morning. So there are a lot of wow factors here this year. There really are. I mean, you saw when you walked through the building, the first thing you see when you come into the exhibit area is just, well, it's a completely different atmosphere. Mm -hmm. It's almost like you're walking into an art exhibit. Mm -hmm. Everybody has their own little area, and they're taking their spin on the theme this year. So that's, it's really exciting to see what they do, and, and just, it's, it's amazing. These people are very, very talented in their own way. Yeah. We've got trains. We've got Paris. We've got a tiny house. We've got a swimming pool. I mean, there's, there's a lot going on here. There's a little bit of everything. And, and there's flowers, and there's mm -hmm. lots of green, and, and it's March and Maine. So we've got what we can work with, and I think that they've done amazing jobs. These people are experts at what they do. So the point is, is the public come in. These people are here representing what they do. These are the owners of their, their companies. Ask them questions. They'll tell you. Mm -hmm. they'll, they'll go on and on and on, and they've got a lot of knowledge to, to, to um, hand over to everybody. A really great way to kick the season, and you guys have been doing this for nearly two decades now. Yes, it's 18 years, and you know, through the years we've grown. Um, we've always got to stay on top of the, the what's going to be new. You know, how do we change it up? And we take a lot from what the public tells us each year. We take the criticism, we take the good comments, we kind of get them all together, and and we want to give something a little bit new every year. We do our best, we really do, and I think that these guys really work very, very hard. That's great. And the people have a have a hand, have a say in this. They have a hand in picking. The uh, one of the awards they do, yeah. The, the professional judges make the the most of the awards, but there's one that goes throughout the show, and that's the people's choice. So as you walk into the exhibit area, you're handed a ballot, encouraged to uh, put that into thought because you never know who that's going to go to. Last year, it went to a newcomer, so it's really nice to see. The, the new blood getting these awards. And you'll find that out today, right? Yeah, they're usually drawn around 2 o'clock, around that time. So right. it'll, be, it'll be posted on our website. Wonderful. Thanks, Justina. Thank so if you want to head out and uh, cast your, your vote, you head on down here today for a taste of spring at the Portland Flower Show. Norma Katie? All right. I like how she said earlier, it's like her own movie set. It is. A springtime movie set. It really is. People and, get creative. And I think Morgan's going to spend the rest of the day in there. I mean, it's just it's the aroma of that place. I know. The fragrance of the flowers and everything. It's really cool. So if you have a little cabin fever and you've had a long winter like we all have had and you want to get out and just get some signs of spring, that's the place to be. That is.